Well, an apology from the man accused of murdering his friend, then escaping from prison guards. KITV4's Nana Okawa has details on Teddy Mune's sentencing. It's rare to see smiles in a courtroom just before a guilty plea. But Teddy Mune wore one today. Rare goes hand in hand with Mune. He took off running from a transport van as he was headed to court back in February. Mune darted across the street and tried to yank a woman out of her car at Voyager Middle School. But she was buckled up. Mune said sorry to her today. I sincerely and full heartedly apologize for any physical and emotional pain that I may have caused you and your family. I had no right to involve you in my little escapade on the morning of February 20th. I can only imagine what it must have felt like to have someone trying to pull you from your vehicle for no reason. He apologized some more. I do not seek leniency or any type of sympathy today. There are no excuses for any of my actions. I am a 30-year-old adult and I'm supposed to know right from wrong. Still, he received some sympathy. It came from the judge. Since you were born, everybody who's ever had anything to do with you has let you down. It's true. And I'm sorry for that, Mr. Mooney. On the other hand, as you yourself rightfully say, there's no excuse for this kind of behavior. That kind of behavior sent police on an island-wide search for more than 11 hours. It also exposed problems. Four vans of prisoners arrived in an area only built for two. Inmates were offloaded outside of a secure area of circuit court, and Mune didn't have any leg restraints. Mune received five years for the escape and 10 years for the robbery. His murder trial is set for October. Nana Okawa, KITV 4 News.